Hi, I'm Samwa from Eastern Music and today I'm going to teach you how to put markers on your erhu so that beginners uh, will have an easier time to get the intonation correct. Okay, as you know, the erhu is a fretless instrument unlike the guitar or the zhongran which uh, where they have frets on the instrument the erhu does not have any frets so a lot of beginners might find it a struggle to hold at the correct position to get the correct pitch. Okay, so there are actually three ways uh, you can do. You can put markers on your erhu. The first, the first way is to get one of these labels. Okay, on these labels there are different markings which you can stick on the neck of your erhu. and it will look like this. Now the good thing about having these labels is all the markings are already on the sticker, on the labels and you just need to stick on the neck of your erhu and you're done. But the bad thing about this is there's a fixed position for your ching ching which means that uh, some people would like to have their ching ching higher or lower um, if they use these labels, um, the pitch will not be correct. And um, personally, I don't really like to stick labels uh, or stickers or sticky tape on uh, my erhu itself because uh, I'm afraid that um, if you stick it for a long while, um, if you when we peel it off, it might damage the wood. Okay, so if you do not have access to the labels that I mentioned just now, uh, what do you do? Well, you can make your own um, labels and uh, this is actually the preferred method um, of uh, a lot of instructors. Okay, What you will need is a chromatic tuner and a correction pen. Okay, so what you are going to do is you are going to put markings not on the neck itself but on the string itself. The good thing about putting markings on the string itself is you get to press or you get to hold the exact position where the pitch is correct. So some people they like to use a scotch tape. Um, and stick on the neck. Um, sometimes if you do that, when you play to the lower positions, uh, there is this uh, parallax error and you might not be able to get the correct pitch. So if you put the markings on the string itself, you can just know the exact position where to hold and where the pitch is. Okay, so how do you put the markings? First, you tune your erhu. So you know the outer string is a. You can take either string, you can take either uh, the inner string or you can take the outer string. Okay, assuming that, um, okay, I'll, I'll be fixing the markings with using the outer string. So first, get A and know that to get uh, the next note uh, B, you first play and get the correct position where you get the B note. And what you do is you use the correction pen and you put a little dot At the position where you hold the B note. Okay. Then you go to you go to C sharp. And you put another marking where 
it is at C sharp. And the next note will be D. Same thing. We put another marking here. Okay. Then next will be E.